NatCon is a national conference, hence the name NatCon, and essentially it's a job fair, networking opportunity, um, and there's a lot of fun to be had with all student veterans of America's chapters from across the entire country getting together in one place, doing all those things. I wanted to go to NatCon because I recently attended the Leadership Institute, also held by SVA, and that opened my eyes to a lot of training and mentorship opportunities that I didn't know were out there. So I wanted to capitalize on that experience by bringing that newfound, refreshed energy to NatCon and continue to ride that wave of success. To prepare for NatCon, we had Zoom sessions with prior people who have attended NatCon and what to expect. We also attended SBA's How To NatCon uh, workshops that gave us more of an insight from people that host and work uh, previous NatCons. One professional goal I accomplished was definitely expanding my network to a different level outside of just the SBA, um, and I, I'm really glad that I accomplished that. The preparation I did prior to going to NatCon is researching the different breakout sessions and also speaking to previous members about their experience and what I should expect. NatCon wasn't just an event that was there for solely professional use. It was there to be able to forge and continue to forge and strengthen our relationships with people we had met in Leadership Institute all over the country. One professional goal I accomplished during NatCon was getting more connected with the women veterans there and the organization that surrounds them. The one professional goal that I accomplished while at NatCon was getting to um, talk to the VA um, and then get more information on the claims process and then also talking to them uh, to potentially get hired in the future. Uh, I saw it as an opportunity for myself to network and get my brand out there to promote my personal brand as well as my team brand. The value I get out of being involved with the Joseph A. Marshall Veterans Center is countless programs and opportunities and scholarships that I would have never known about. Um, having everyone bounce information off of each other and kind of work off of each other helps all of us grow and come up together. Being a part of the Joseph A. Marshall Veterans Center allows me to have a community and have friends kind of like when I was in the military. I think it's a really beneficial thing to just come in and talk to the people here, talk to Danny, talk to us, um, because no matter what, you're gonna get something out of it. We're also just a really supportive and great group to really just get some ideas off of, um, and I really think it's an important thing to be a part of. I still feel like I'm part of the